what is up guys we're back with some more hogwarts legacy i did the side quest where we had to collect some some monsters in order to learn a new spell i wanted to start off the episode real quick just with uh us learning this spell before we move Excellent on to some other stuff my brother's doing well can't say I'm... i take Dang, too many people to talking right there i completed your assignment professor i'm ready to learn bombarda now good bombarda now, this spell comes Bombata. with a caveat it should only be used when necessary the exploding charm as you might suspect can hurt people use caution when casting oh, no way. it exploding charm i will professor i will hold you to that promise now I'm using you must everybody. be precise in your wand movements we don't want you blowing your hand off go ahead Nice and steady wand movements. Remember, the exploding charm is highly volatile. Well done. Now, let us put it into practice, shall we? Go ahead and try it on the pumpkins. Bobada. Excellent Ooh, wand work. Okay. Cast the spell just like that every time. Assured and in control. Why did I have that? I had that on the bottom one. Okay, sweet, sweet. I like that. Cool, now that we got that one, uh the next side quest I kinda wanna do is the Slytherin one. Uh we get another spell Imperio. And so we gotta go meet up with Sebastian uh, all the way out yonder. But luckily we got a fast travel spot over here. So won't have to waste too much time there. What's like a place right out of a storybook? Wonder where they're off. I swear, I love the fact that you get to ride the broom, and then you also have like the option of oh, some balloons here. You have the option of using uh, like your flying mounts, like the, the hippogriff or the thestral. I swear, I hit it. <laughs> And at least nobody can hit us like off our off our broom oh, too. Here's a pleasant surprise. Yeah. I believe one of Slytherin's students stumbled upon the relic during an assignment to study sarcophagi in this catacomb. From what I read in a report by the student, they weren't permitted to take it with them, so I must assume it's still here. As I mentioned earlier, this relic grants its holder the power to reverse dark magic curses. If it's in this catacomb, I have to find it. For Anne. I need to see her. I'd be interested to know what else the student discovered. Have a look. Unfortunately, there's no name on it, but I suspect if it was important enough for Slytherin to stash in his spellbook, it's worthy of further study. I'm ready to explore the catacombs. All right, let's go. Perhaps we can visit Anne when we finished. Perfect. By the way, Ominous has been asking about you. You didn't tell him what we were doing, did you? I didn't. I promise. Good. Ominous would be livid if he knew what we were about to do. Yeah, he's a uh, little soft for Slytherin. Got to come with something yielded more than I imagined. Learning about our answers was illuminating. However, I stumbled upon something else I could not ignore in an area behind the great room which had suffered decay amid the turned over sarcophagi. Sarcophagi. I discovered an oddly shaped relic. Immediately, I sensed its power. I would be thrilled to study the relic further. 
Only the removal of objects were allowed. I'll be interested to compare what lies inside to what I've read about this catacomb. I'm sure that foul smell is the scent of success. Try not to lose your nerve just yet. Rebellio. At least now we know we're not alone here. Perhaps that was it. And the rest of the tomb will be insect free. Yeah, the spiders aren't insects. Don't <laughs> start. Akio! Opening all of these is tempting. We're here for a reason. I'd say opening them all is just a rebellion. Accio. This room is full of drugs. Guardium Leviosa. Leviosa. Finding a chest in the new Rebellion chest. was not brilliant. Uh. Read the world of another spot. I shall sleep better tonight. Revelio. Accio. Okay, does that, does that not work? <laughs> I always got to do some exploring. Ooh, and I got to level up. Nice noise. that underwent expansion Rebellion. and ran into problems, often cave-ins, and then were abandoned. Exactly. Expelliarm will be fine, though. Confringo! Rebellion. Incendio! Surrounded by grandeur. Grandeur and then some. Even an altar with a pile of bones. Lovely. Bones outside a sarcophagus. Seems odd. There's something here by the altar.
Earning the Imperious Curse. What did you find? Rebellion. Not much. Let me pull these out. Looks like part of a student's diary. It mentions plans to return for the relic and conjuring barricades using bones. Of course. The student's summary referenced the space beyond the great room, which means this can't be a dead end. Let's divide and conquer. You work on sorting out the bone barricades. I'll look around and see what we missed. Hold on to that diary entry. There may be more to it. It does mention something else. It says their next assignment was learning the Imperius curse. Really? Interesting. We need to focus on moving beyond this room. But let me think for a moment. Do you think the pages were left here on purpose? Slytherin mentioned a student who excelled in charms and always carried a satchel stuffed full of notes. They might have been left on purpose, or the student may have simply dropped them. Of course. I'll start to search for those barricades. Brilliant. Rebellion to this than even I imagined. Look, bones stacked oddly on either side of this archway. Hmm. Leave no stone unturned. Or in this case, no bone. Accio. Rebellion. This archway's been barricaded. We can find a way through. Accio. Let me enter. Did you hear that? We're in a tomb. I assume eerie sounds come with the territory. Accio. Revelio. Accio. Sure, why it's not letting me it's pick you guys out. We've made it this far, but clearly we have more to do. Oh. 
Rickety Bone Bridge complete. Incendium. Accio. Revelio. Accio. We got him, Leviosa. Weird how it wasn't letting me get those. You've done it. I knew we'd get through. I felt it in my bones. Nice. Rebellio. Before we trudge on further, I've just realized something. The student's diary mentions the Imperious Curse. I wouldn't be surprised if we're going to need it here. It's an unforgivable, but useful when you're outnumbered. Places the victim completely under the caster's control. So, if you'd like to learn Imperio, I can teach you. Where did you learn the Imperious Curse? I taught myself. Don't tell Ominous that I've told you. It's not exactly something I can brag about, but it may come in handy. I think you ought to know it. Shouldn't I know more about what the curse entails? Remember the Blasting Curse? Same idea, except when it comes to unforgivable curses, your intention has to be clear. You have to mean it. It's probably wise to know the spell. I couldn't agree more. A spell that could save your life shouldn't be unforgivable. You have a lot at stake. You have an ability that evidently no one's seen for centuries. All right, let's so go. Your wand movement. It's not an easy spell to master. Something troubling ahead. Be on your guard. Now that I got that spell though, uh, I think I want to definitely equip it. Oops, I don't know why I pressed option. Temporarily forces enemies to fight as if they were your companion. Okay. Actually pretty clutch. I see those huge ass spiders over there. So let's first head this way. Another barricade. Considering how well you did on the last Accio. one, you cinch. How gracious of you. I tried. 
All right, that didn't work. <laughs> Noticed the symbols on the door, so I was like, okay. <laughs> you are head and shoulders above these bows. Nicely done. Rebellion. I see why Slytherin's student was so entranced with this place. For a moment there, I thought that would never end. Rebellion. Yeah, but we built our own. Fucked them up. Hell. Could it be? The note and rendition of the relic, it matches. 
This must be where the student left the relic. I can't believe it. After all this, it lines up. We've really found it. What do you suppose is meant by the dark sacrifice required to realize the relic's potential? Gotta kill I someone. Have no idea. But we're here for the relic. The note advises to leave the relic alone. I assure you, we were meant to find this. For Anne's sake, I'm taking it. Let's get to Feldcroft. I must keep this relic secret, especially from my uncle. Oh, snap. Oh, boy, done popped up. <laughs> How your blind ass follow us? Ominous. Ominous. The sounds we kept hearing, it was you. You gave me no choice. I had to follow you. Sebastian, please, leave the relic alone. We can find another way to help Anne. I'm sorry, Ominous, but I'm taking it. No, you're not. If you won't put it back, then I will. Hold on, both of you. Sebastian, please, take a step back. Fine, but Ominous knows I won't step back from a fight. Can't believe this. Uh-oh. Don't tell we're gonna have to use uh, you hear? first on him. I was glad to hear you tell Sebastian to leave the relic. We need to stand together. Convince Sebastian this is wrong. And if nothing will change his mind? Something has to. I need your help. You're right. This seems far riskier than Sebastian realizes. Good. We're agreed. We don't allow him to leave here with the relic. I do think we should talk to him. But I fear we won't stop him from taking the relic. What are you suggesting? I'm suggesting we negotiate. We allow Sebastian to leave with the relic under one condition. After this, no more. You know he's I not going to do that's that. That's what we agreed to in the scriptorium. I'm being taken for a fool. You're not ominous. This may be the only way to keep your friendship intact. Let's trust him to know what's best. Fine. If I trust him on this, I'm trusting you too. The dark arts seem harmless until it's too late. <sighs> Go then. Leave with the relic. I'll not say a word more. I hope I don't regret this. Sebastian, we're ready. What is it? I haven't changed my mind. Ominous has. Let's go. What? Ominous? I'll explain on the way. Come on. Is that the fast way out? Incendio. You said on the wrong one. Incendio. Yeah. They be getting me with that. <laughs> As we were leaving, Ominous wouldn't even acknowledge me. That's not like him. He was troubled, Sebastian. Even though we agreed to it all, it's been a lot to take in. I thought he understood. He knew we couldn't give up. All of this is too important for Anne.
They literally want us to run there. to Feldcroft, I'd rather Anne not know what had to be done to get this relic. She thinks like ominous. It did only upset her. I mean, shouldn't we respect her wishes? Is good? What is it? Smoke! Over there, by the hamlet. Uh-oh. Feldcroft's in trouble. They're under attack. Loyalists. Let's hurry. <laughs> okay, the camera's kind of effing me up right now. What's going on, Anne? What's wrong? Uh oh. Uh -oh. oh, snap. He made him slit his own throat. Boy, what have you done? Saved my sister. Still an unforgivable curse. From that damn book, no doubt. Your father would be ashamed. You've gone too far, Sebastian. Stay away from her. From all of us. But he's slippery, and I feel like he, he needs to learn that. What did my uncle expect me to do? The Imperious Curse saved Anne's life. I agree. Goblin was going to kill her. You did what you had to do. If I have to keep proving that to my uncle, I will. He cannot banish me from my own home. From my sister. It might be best to let him calm down a while. May I speak to him? Perhaps I can help to ease the tension a bit. You may be right. Very well. Probably best if I get away from here for a while. I'll head back to Hogwarts. Wanted to sell stuff, but won't let me. Thinking. 
Pardon me, Mr. Sallow. What Sebastian did was inexcusable. You cannot possibly be about to defend him. Sebastian and I have encountered Ranrock's loyalists before. That goblin would have killed Anne. This family does not resort to using dark magic, even against our enemies. What Sebastian did cannot be undone. That you are defending Sebastian's behavior at all tells me everything I need to know. You are as guilty as he is. Oh. Sebastian is to come nowhere near Feldcroft, nowhere near Anne. Unforgivable curses are so named for a reason. If I hear that either of you continues down this path, if either of you uses dark magic, I will notify the headmaster oh, immediately. Why, Sebastian? Didn't even get a chance sure to use that new spell, like actually. Place like this. But, guys, I'm going to end the episode off here, and we'll pick back up. Oh, actually, no, look at that. It says, speak to Sebastian in the Undercrow. Might as well just get that in the video. See what he has to say. Off on another adventure, are we? Always. Oh, yeah? I wish I had better news about your uncle and Anne. Well, what did he say? I'm afraid he wants you nowhere near Feldcroft. Nor Anne. I had to stop that goblin from killing my sister. He had no right to banish me from my own twin. <sighs> if he thinks banishing me means I'm going to give up on Anne, he's sorely mistaken. He also said he cannot excuse the use of dark magic in any form. And that if he hears of either of us using it, he'll go straight to Professor Black. Huh? That relic, dark magic or not, is the key to saving Anne. To reverse that curse. I will not lose Anne for good. I should send the crest to Anne. She'll know that we need to meet. I'm afraid I don't follow. Nothing, just a thought. Now I'm more determined than ever to learn what power that relic has. Okay. What did you mean you'd send Anne a crest so that she'd know to meet you? It's... We just lost our parents, and we were packing up to go and live with Solomon. We couldn't take everything. She was carefully organizing her prized possessions, a box of artifacts she'd collected to do with our family. Jewelry, cards, old photographs. She got to her favorite, a handmade crest, and without a second thought, she handed it to me. This will keep you safe, she said. It holds no enchantment, but I've kept it with me since. That's how I can reach Anne. I'll get the crest to her with plans to meet. Be careful, Sebastian. Your uncle could intercept it or be expelled. Even if Ominous is upset with us, he has no love lost for his family. He'd use their connections to the headmaster if we needed his help. Uh, I doubt I it. I to hear from you, though. But okay. Thank you. I very much appreciate you standing by me through all of this. I'll send you an hour when I have news. All right. Better not have news as soon as I leave out this room, though. Now I think it's safe to end the episode off guys, but I hope you enjoyed make sure you leave a like for the video It helps out the video a lot and also subscribe to the channel if you've yet to subscribe But with that said guys stay sharp later